I think it was quite good what I said about calming things down. Could we calm things down a bit? Because I feel like I can't get a word in edgeways. I think that was okay, although perhaps I could make it less pointed if I said that I feel that I'm being left out of the conversation, that would be less pointed at anybody. And having said that, I need to accept that I can't make her stop. But I just felt she was going on and on and on and dominating the conversation. I'm not sure that I really handled it appropriately. Anyway, going back to the puppet, how does the puppet represent my own feelings? I suppose it's about being positive about your disability, your disability being something added rather than subtracted, and she looked so happy. And then to be cast aside in the gutter, I feel someone may have stolen her, thinking she was a purse. I've come such a long way trying to be positive about my, my ordeal in hospital and it was just too cruel. I really grieved for her like a person, like she was a piece of myself. I just howled with grief. And possibly releasing other griefs that I've not been able to face. There may be still other interpretations I haven't thought about. I made more noise about her than I may have about some of the people in my life. Sometimes when you lose a person, the pain is too much and you just block it out. It makes me wonder what I was really grieving for and I haven't really got to the bottom of it.